Hi all, hope you've had a blessed day today. Tonight, I want to talk about Proverbs chapter 12, verse 25. Anxiety weighs down the heart, but a kind word cheers it up. You know, in today's world, there's so many things to be concerned about. There's so much to worry about. Hurricanes, earthquakes, forest fires, cancer, COVID, our kids, our jobs, our health. The list goes on and on. It's like a laundry list. But a lot of the things that we concern ourselves with are mostly out of our control. Because we can't always control what the world does and what happens around us. But what we can do is we can choose how we react to it and how we handle ourselves. You can choose to be worried, anxious, bitter, or you can choose to be happy and joyful, seeing the good in things rather than the ugly, offering encouragement, looking for God's fingerprints on things. How about trying to find something to be grateful for every day of your life? It's like, Hummingbirds that are attracted to the nectar of a flower, while vultures look for dead things to eat upon. Darkness and light, good and evil. They've been there since the beginning of time and they'll be there at the end of time. We just gotta decide who we're gonna put our trust in and how we're gonna spend our lives here on earth. Right now, there's a lot of scary things happening in the world. But because of Jesus, there's always good present. Always. Even in our darkest times, Jesus brings the light to us. He's carrying the weight of the world on his shoulders, so we don't have to. He's already burned a path where there wasn't one. This just proves that we're not alone. You know, the hope that we put in Christ isn't just positive vibes. It's hope based on truth. We can fight anxiousness with hope. We can fight worry with truth-filled encouragement. We can fight the darkness with light. Whenever you're feeling anxious or worried about something, ask God for help. Remember, He's only a prayer away. God bless you all.